Leather skirts are very fun and they're great because you can find them really at every vintage store. There's basically a leather skirt section in all of them. I'm Sammy Miro and my life revolves around vintage. In this series, I show you how to find the perfect vintage piece and how to make it your own. What's most important is figuring out which kind of shape looks best for you. Do you want form fitting or a little bit looser? Then on top of that, do you want one that is longer, like below the knee, above the knee, mini skirt, and then we can go from there. Okay, this is pretty amazing because I know we're on the hunt for a skirt, but I found a skirt, and that's pretty freaking special. I don't think I've ever seen a vintage leather skirt like this before, but it definitely needs a lot of alterations, and this one will be a really fun one to see all of the crazy things that we're gonna have to do to it. I guess first of all, we would have to see it on you, what's gonna happen, Yeah. but since it's so much and you're so little, we have to take all of this out on the side and then flip it around and take some of this out too. This is everything that needs to come out of it, right? Yeah. Wow. Okay, yeah, great, so. So it's yeah. like a nice arch. But at the end, it's just taking it in the sides, a little bit in the back and shortening it. Great. So it's very simple, okay? Yeah, that's perfect. That's good. The sports are also really trendy right now. They're something that I wore when I was a little girl I paired the, the leather skirt with an all black outfit. All black outfits are always really chic. When in doubt, we're an all black outfit. But it's fun to add a pop of color with them too. Whether it's a pop of red lipstick or pink nails, some yellow vintage sunglasses. You can also do some sort of a jacket with it. I put it with a vintage pink moto jacket. Leather gets better with age, so with vintage, it's a perfect match.